Hi, right, it's the meeting of the Committee of Committees, 5 p.m. January 9th, 2023. Happy New Year to you guys. All right. Mr. Teacher, would you mind praying? Absolutely. Heavenly Father, Lord, we come to you. Um, just humble, Lord, and just um, thankful that we get to uh, to be a, uh, in a nation that we can pray, Lord, to open our meetings. And I pray that you please just uh, watch over the, the folks that are here, Lord, in the, in the uh, in the seats behind me, Lord, and watch over the folks at the table, and watch over the folks that couldn't make it, Lord. I pray that you'll please just allow us to do uh, things that are good, good for all of the the county, Lord, as we move forward on on everything as small or as large as it could be, Lord. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. 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 All right. Do I have a motion for approval of agenda? Make a motion. Awesome. Motion by Commissioner Miller, second by Commissioner Teacher. All in favor, say aye. 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 Um, motion for approval of minutes. Make a motion. Commissioner Miller, no. motion. Commissioner uh, Janong, second. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? All right. Recognition of the public. We have Megan Brenning. Okay. Close enough. <laughs> uh, again, Megan Brenning, thank you guys very much for giving me the opportunity to speak to you tonight. I believe all of you received my resume and a letter explaining why I believe I should be considered for the board um, position with the live public libraries. Um, I just wanted to kind of share that information with you. Uh, I have books have always been a passion of mine and literature as well. I bring, in addition to that, a unique set of skills that will help the county and will help the public library boards. I've been a founding member of multiple nonprofits, including um, a local nonprofit, uh, well, two local nonprofits, one out of Nashville that has raised almost a million dollars in the last seven years for the community, including areas of summer. Uh, part of being on a, a founding board is that you have to do everything. You have to do all the roles of the board. All of the roles are working members, so I've got a very intimate familiarity with what it means to be on a board, what it means to put the effort in that you need to run an organization, um, and organizations that are large. In addition to being on multiple boards, I also volunteer my time with multiple nonprofits, including writing grants for a nonprofit that helps to take care of foster children. So benefit of having that experience of writing grants is that I can help support the library as we write grants to get additional funding outside of our county for our for the programming that our libraries do. Um, I have extensive experience in every aspect of nonprofit board management in both my personal and professional life. So as a professional I'm a nonprofit or I am a program manager. And in the past, I have done work with nonprofits from a professional standpoint, helping, for, helping them to grow their businesses, helping them to grow their reach, their impact, and their ability to do their work. Uh, I focus on creating efficiencies, adopting lean methodologies, which means you're going to get more done with less dollars, which is a huge benefit to our taxpayers in our county. Managing a budget and ensuring that dollars are spent responsibly is critical to my role as a program manager. That's what I do every single day. Uh, my technical background actually gives me an edge as well. So my background is electrical engineering, which means uh, I work very closely, very often in IT. Uh, that's where we kind of get a shovel. So I work with a lot of different organizations running different technical softwares, helping with expensive upgrades, um, helping with making sure that you choose the right software, looking through ROIs, RFPs, all of the information that you would need to maintain a software system like what the library has in place or to decrease the cost of maintaining uh, software like what the libraries have in place. Um, I'm responsible <coughs> in my role for driving collaboration, um, especially for driving collaboration in organizations that don't often get along. If you've ever been in a corporate space, you know that IT and business don't get along. You know that there are lots of different groups that don't. <coughs> want to collaborate who have to on a regular basis. It's my role to help that happen. So I'm very good at making sure that people who have very different opinions can bring their opinions and thoughts to the table and who can also make them um, make them work together in a way that brings everybody to the best possible position. So success for me here would be working with people with diverging objectives together for positive and effective means in a way that helps to create efficient uh, systems when there are libraries to continue to provide what we do for our community. On a personal note, these libraries in Summer County have been a blessing to my family of readers.
years. I cannot afford to keep my kids in books the way that they read them. <laughs> so the libraries have been um, a blessing in that way, but also the many different programs that we have utilized throughout the years as they've grown. Um, according to my research, there are currently no mothers on the library board, and there are no, or well, no mothers of young children on the library board. So I have a unique perspective there as well, and I think this is a large gap on our library board. Um, mothers of young children desperately need the library. <laughs> Any mom who's been stuck at home over fall break for an entire rainy week will tell you that the library is a godsend. And so I believe that the programming for children is such a critical part that we should have representation on the board of someone who knows how to utilize that, who is desperate to utilize that, that resource. And I would be honored to give back to my community in this way. So I know that you guys already have a recommendation for the library board position. I would just ask that you take the time this evening to discuss my resume, my application, and compare it to the other applicants that you've had uh, before making a final decision this evening. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, that closes public comments. I record, uh, report the chairman, I have none. Report the county mayor. No report, Mr. Chairman. All right. Old business, there is none. New business. Uh, first item is Solid Waste Board six year term. County Mayor recommendation <coughs> from Presley Powers. Do I have a motion? I'll make a motion. I'll second it. Okay, second by Commissioner Janung. Uh, is there any discussion or question? Do we know yeah, a little bit about Mr. Powers? I do not. Mr. Mayor? Ms. Powers is currently a research associate for TASSER, uh, lives here in Sumner County, graduate of Tennessee Tech University, uh, did master's at MTSU, has an MPA from Tennessee State University, uh, and is currently in the PhD program for public policy administration at Tennessee State. Uh, let's see, several honors and, and all that. Uh, Basically, her role with uh, TASSER, Tennessee Advisory Commission on Intergovernmental Relations, uh, she has to calculate or is responsible for calculating the fiscal capacity and track infrastructure needs for each county within the state. So she has a good understanding of legislative body, policy decisions, and uh, governmental, intergovernmental matters. I agree. Okay. Uh, Motion to uh, uh -huh. Yeah, we um, we sort of have a motion on the floor, but we can let, then we vote on the uh, discuss. But uh, uh, go ahead. Do we vote for discuss? I don't think so. Okay, so um, let's go ahead and vote for discuss. Uh, properly discharge of that. Make a motion. We discuss. Well, we've already done that. <laughs> let's go ahead and vote. All in favor, say aye. 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 <laughs> opposed. Okay. Now, entertain a motion. I entertain a motion to approve. All right. Second. Second. Uh, is there any other discussion on that? All in favor say aye. Aye. All right. Any opposed? All right. We'll pass that on with a positive recommendation from this committee to full commission. Um, local emergency, regional planning, and civil service board. Uh, there were no recommendations. I move to uh, group and defer until February. Aye. Second. Second by Commissioner Teacher. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? All right. Board of Construction Appeals. We had a... Um, Fred Welland uh, withdrew because he's actually said he was tired of all the Uber development in Galton and is moving to Florida. So he's an, he's an electrical um, engineer. Um, we had one empty spot yet to fill in that. Um, and I was going to see if you guys might be open just to deferring this till February till we have a full slate. Second. All right, second by Commissioner Miller. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. All right. I'm going to defer till February on Board of Construction Appeals. Uh, Industrial Development Board. John Miller withdrew his uh, application. He kind of, um, his wife wanted him to for some health reasons. Um, and so we will just defer that. Um, I make a motion to defer the Industrial Development Board until uh, February again. Second. Okay. All right. All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? All right. Motion carried. E911 Board. Uh, County <coughs> Mayor recommendation Teddy Baird. Uh, do we have a motion? I'll make a motion. I'll second your motion. Right, for second. I'd like for a decision. 
All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? All right. So move for discussion. Teddy Baird. Um, I reached out. I had some mutual friends I saw, and I think he's a fireman, if I'm not mistaken. He's been in emergency services a long time, so um, I, I don't know anything else about him. So. Lifelong Sumner County citizen, graduated Portland High School in 94, uh, worked in Tool and Dive for three years after high school, uh, started volunteer fire department in 93, when he's 17. Uh, Part-time dispatcher for two years at Sumner County EMS, full-time dispatcher for eight months, became a career firefighter, 97 with the city of Gallatin the past 15 years. He's been a lieutenant, uh, well, yeah, past 15 years, lieutenant for Gallatin Fire Department. Uh, he's given an opportunity to be a shift captain at Portland that he took, uh, where he supervised seven other people on the shift, uh, married, to a teacher at Portland East Middle School. Uh, and they have three kids, Caleb 16, Eli 14, Elena 11, and serves on church and Portland Cares Board. That's about it. Any other questions, discussion? Mm -hmm. uh, I'll make a motion to approve. I second. Second by Commissioner Teacher. All in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? Motion carries. Ag Extension Service Committee, uh, Commissioner Holmes, I forgot to report, is not here. She's out of town. And so um, she, I, I know, it helped uh, reach out to a lot of, uh, since she's a farm woman herself, but she's already on the Ag Extension Service Committee and recommended and, uh, each one of these people um, for the board. And I move to group and approve all four. Second. All right. Second by Commissioner uh, Miller. Uh, all in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? Uh, Public Records Commission Archives Board to your term. County Mayor recommendation is uh, Commissioner Baker Ream. Um, is there a motion? I'll make a motion we discuss. Second. Okay. Motion by Commissioner Teachner, second by Commissioner Miller. Uh, all in favor say aye. 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 I'm going to be a no. So, all right. Motion carries. So, how long is I couldn't find how long Baker has served on this? I don't know. He's here in the audience. If you Can like I ask? Him. Baker, how long have you served? I've been on it probably six or eight years. I don't remember quite a while. Got it. Most people don't even know this board exists. What? It meets what, twice a year. I see. What is it that? What is it? Your they oversee board. the archives, and not. I mean, that's and that's. They don't really run the archives. They just kind of. The board that uh, the archives reports to. Um, they're responsible for public records coming from the jail, or, I mean, the uh, courts, the um, uh, trustee's office, uh, the uh, recorder's office, clerk's office, that kind of thing. Um, all of the positions on it are required by state law, designated for, for who should sit be on it, and there's one spot for a commissioner. The others are county clerk. Uh, ar archivist, uh, genealogist, county historian, um, and the uh, uh, public, I uh, mean, uh, the uh, uh, recorder of deeds. Those are the, those nine one commissioner. That's the spots that are um, on there. Got it. And uh, and you taught history, correct? Correct. Got it. Okay. For thirty years. Yeah, I appreciate. It. Okay, my thoughts are. Um, had a few folks that kind of reached out, were interested in it, um, on the commission. It's commission only, correct? Um, well, I think the first motion is I'm, I'm just going to make a motion that we do not uh, accept Baker, just because I I like to just kind of just see some other options there, so. I think, I think we have a motion a, from Commissioner Teacher. Second. And just a motion to deny. Yeah, motion to deny. Second. Um, all right. Um, all in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? All right. Um, we will aye. just let that one. I mean, uh, just, just not pass it on, right? Just, just we leave. don't have to. Let's, would you um, I don't make think another motion to keep I don't it back in so. committee? All right. I'll entertain a motion to keep it in committee. Yeah, keep it in committee. Because I'd like to, I'd like to discuss some other names. All right. So you want to defer this until next month? Yes. All right. A motion to defer by Commissioner Teacher. 
Second by Commissioner Janun. Yeah. Question? That's a county mayor recommendation. So Correct. How can we, I mean, if we keep it in committee. Maybe just some other people. My, my thought, can I discuss? I was thinking some other people could maybe maybe put their names in with the county mayor, just uh, since it's his option on that, we could just kind of just see what happens with it, um, just for a little change up. Nothing against Baker, but. I've only received one request, and that was from Baker that asked to serve. Yeah, so, so I haven't there. heard from anybody else. Kind of. So if you want to reach out to them. Okay, I'll reach out. There's a couple of folks. But if, would you, you just have them reach out to them? Okay. If they're still interested, so. All right, so we had a motion uh, to defer. We had a second. All those say aye. Okay. Any opposed? All right, we got this month. Uh, library board, um, present member is a Gallatin member expiring, uh, replacing with another Gallatin member, uh, Ruth Fennell, who ran for Gallatin City Council, uh, highly qualified um, a businesswoman <coughs> dealing with operations and uh, processes. Um, so I make a motion to uh, approve Ruth Fennell. Second. Second by Commissioner Teacher. Any discussion? Teacher. I mean, Commissioner Miller, <laughs> uh, any discussion? Uh, I have a discussion. So I, I, I love, uh, can, I, can I speak to Megan? Megan, I, I love that you apply. Um, I've spoken with Ruth. I felt pretty confident about moving forward with her. And um, I, I, I encourage you to, to you know, be considered for it again. I don't want you to be disheartened by that. But I just, I, I'm going to. I feel confident that I want to vote for Ruth in that situation. I just want to tell you that. Can I ask you a question back? Mm -hmm. um, I submitted my application before the last meeting, mm -hmm. and uh, I have not heard back from any member on this committee asking me any questions about that application. So it sounds like you've spoken to Ruth. I went to Deborah directly. She said she was um, an advocate and a supporter of me. Mm -hmm. If I submit that information and none of you reach out to me, how do it, does anyone ever get Appointments of Jim, I'm going to take this. This is kind of our order right here. So, um, so um, basically, uh, we're looking for, a, for this part, a Gallatin member, too many initial members. Um, the library appointees are at the pleasure of the commission. It's just that simple. So, um, I mean, we're, we're, we're making changes in the library board, the makeup of the board, um, that aligns with the vision of the majority of this commission. And uh, it's like I said from the commission floor last week, if everybody who keeps asking why they might not make it rejected or might not, I'll just straight up say it. Uh, we're, gonna, we're looking forward to people who are aligned with our vision of moving the ball down the field um, and uh, who are going to help fulfill uh, what we got elected uh, for as the majority of commissioners. And so I don't, I don't, but how do you know that if you don't interview or talk to anyone who submits their information? Um, well, I mean, we, we did talk to Ms. Fennell, and we're happy to uh, talk to you. And I mean, you believe you came and spoke tonight, but um, this is the appointment. Um, this is who we, we are uh, appointing tonight. And we've had <coughs> uh, two people from Hendersonville. We've got a person representing Millersville. Actually, we have three people from Hendersonville already. We have a person representing Millersville, uh, and this will be our uh, second uh, Gallatin person uh, for uh, representation. Um, so we are definitely going to try to be more sensitive to other parts of the county, such as what's more in Portland, uh, and some of these applications. So, um, I mean, that's what we're doing tonight, and that's all I'm going to say about it. So thank you very much. So, uh, we had a motion, then we had a second. Uh, all in favor say aye. Aye. Any opposed? All right. Question passes. Uh, one more motion. Make a motion, Major. All right. Yeah. Meeting at the close.